Well, a clear blue sky over Victoria, and you didn't have to go far today to find love in the air and people feeling it. Valentine's Day has brought out the romantic in most of us. CTV's Astrid Brunschmidt shows us now how love is in the air everywhere. There's a sea of construction paper, glue, and scissors at Doncaster Elementary. Here, you can really feel the love. We made special crafts at school for our big buddies. One special lady has this boy's heart. This is what I made for my mom. Cupid's arrow has struck the young and the old. I like to have fun. She likes to have fun, Richard. And the old chasing the young. The light of my life, my darling. You enjoy this? Oh, well, you don't get a chance to run around all day and tell the young ladies how much you love them? <laughs> how can you not like it? From the Ross Place retirement residence, where the over 65 crowd plays the dating game, to the streets of downtown Victoria. No matter where you turn today, love is in the air. Say you'll be mine forever. We sing three songs and we have about 35 engagements for today. Yep, Victoria is a romantic city. Just ask the Downtown Victoria Business Association. People love their city and the number one thing they love about it is to show it off. And that's just what they did during the Kiss in the City contest. Finding a location and taking a photo with their loved one is just a ton of fun. You can bet the winners are having a ton of fun. Michaela and Trenton, who took this photo right about here on Ford and Broad Street, don't even know they've won the Kiss in the City contest. Turns out they're out of town on their own romantic Valentine's getaway. For those of us staying at home, how about a modern take on traditional Valentine's chocolate? This comes in a cup, and it really is guilt-free. Chocolate's coming from one place and not a blend of different chocolates. If you're going to be making ethical choices about what kind of coffee you want to purchase and that you want it to be fairly traded and not to exploit children and the workers. I think that the same ethics should be brought to choosing what kind of chocolate you're going to put into uh, a mocha on Valentine's Day or every day of the year for that matter. Oh, that's good. That's really good. And so are any and all special treats today because in the end, it's the thought that counts. Happy Valentine's Day. I love you. <laughs>